No matter how many years pass, you people will always be little more than fools. What do you mean by you people? Oh. Golden wildfire. A symbol of the past. A symbol of the past. Is that Rhea? Maybe? I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> Claude's swift military actions save Ordelia territory from immediate danger. However, the Empire's situation has drastically changed. The Kingdom and Central Church are closing in on Garrig Mach, placing Edelgard at a disadvantage. After receiving a request for aid, the Federation Army rushes to the scene. Hmm. Edelgard requesting reinforcements from us. This is not a matter that we can respond to lightly. Why? It seems pretty straightforward to me. Hilda, do you truly believe that Edelgard would so readily put herself in our debt had she any other choice? That does not sound like the Edelgard I know. She prefers her debts flow in the opposite direction. True. Huh. Sounds like you two have something in common. <laughs> I will not deny it. In fact, that is precisely what gives me such insight into her current predicament. Make no mistake, the situation must be dire if she feels we are her best option. Simply put, were we to refuse her, it may well lead to her downfall. True. What are you getting at, Lawrence? You've got a real dark glint in your eye. The Empire's regime revolves entirely around its current Emperor. If Adrestia were to lose her, it would collapse like a house of cards. I see what you mean. At this point, there's no one in the Imperial line who could realistically inherit the throne. In other words, if we abandon Edelgard in her hour of need, the Empire will fall right along with her. Damn. <laughs> I mean, that's a valid strat if... I don't know. I, I wouldn't trust that because of what's his name, Hubert. He'll find a way. Not an argument I expected from someone as self-righteous as you, Lawrence. That sounds more like... It actually sounds like you, Claude. <laughs> it totally does. And he wouldn't even bat an eye as he said it. It certainly does sound like him. Oh, I'm sorry. And Claude wouldn't even tell his own allies what was going on until it happened. Hey, that's ancient history. Nowadays, we all plot our schemes together. We're doing it right now. <laughs> I guess that's true. Although, maybe that means we're all turning into Claude a bit. How else do you explain what's happened to Lawrence? The idea that I am somehow emulating Claude is preposterous. I am merely proposing what I believe to be the best course of action for Lester. We can debate whether or not we've all become mini Claudes later. For now, let's hear what the King himself thinks we should do. A battle between the Empire and the Knights of Saros with us being the factor that could turn the tides. We've been here before, haven't we? Last time I chose to sacrifice Randolph in order to ensure our victory. Damn. And because I did, we lost Judith to the Ashen Demon. I don't want to make that mistake again. Mm -hmm. oh. This time, we're going to rush to Garrick Mach, wipe out the Central Church's forces, and take down Rhea herself. That's the whole point of this war, right? Take down Rhea? That's the plan that will put an end to this war with as little bloodshed as possible. That makes it the best option we have. Yes, we're effectively rescuing Edelgard. But hey, we could do worse than having an Emperor in our debt. <laughs> if that is what you deem best, you will hear no objections from me. Yes, I find the plan satisfactory. I've got no complaints either. Let's get going. Sounds like we're all in agreement on this one. Just give the word, Your Majesty. Right. We march on Garrick Mach to rescue the Imperial Army. Prepare to move out immediately. Unless some BS happens, this is this should be like towards the end game, right? Because that's legit the point of the wars to defeat Rhea. There's a lot going on there. What the hell? And that's where we are. Yeah, we gotta go through all that. Okay, that's gonna be on my time, of course, like always. <laughs> hey, thanks for your help back there. What did I do? You helped get everyone on the same page. I appreciated the backup. It would have ended up like that even if I didn't say a word. Like I said, we're all turning into you. Yeah, I still don't know what to think about that. <laughs> but if it's true, then you probably deserve the credit. 
You've done a lot to keep our little team unified. True, true. I don't know if I've really done all that much. If anyone should be grateful, it's me. If I ended up on someone else's side, I'm sure people would have gotten all suspicious about my powers. They probably think I was their enemy. Definitely. <laughs> but here, I'm just part of the team. You all really make me feel like I belong. I get that. I felt like an outsider my entire life. But our friends are a pretty open-minded bunch. They even accepted the dare with open arms. Even though they were weird about it at first, but still, yeah. That's exactly the sort of world I dream of. A world where nobody is branded an outsider. Where anyone and everyone is welcome. Life would be a whole lot easier if that's really what Fodlin was like. But the church preaches a very different vision. They use social status to justify prejudice and have no tolerance for those who come from anywhere else or who don't believe in their teachings. There's good there too, of course. But I want to wipe the slate clean and start over. It's fair, yeah. It's ambitious to be sure. But can I count on you to continue fighting by my side? To help me make my dream a reality? Again, this feels like some end game type of conversation since it's like the church is the main enemy, it seems, even though we have to do this as they're in the dark, uh, but yeah. Absolutely. At least until the war's over. But yes, that's as far as the war's concerned, at least, yeah. Wait, that's it? You're just gonna up and leave as soon as the fighting's done? Who knows? Alright, I'll leave it for now. But don't think you're off the hook. We'll pick this up again when the time comes. Anyway, we should press on. I'm sure Edelgard is awaiting our arrival with bated breath. Hmm. Why is she all the way over there? The hell? It's annoying. But anyways, I gotta do all this, and then we'll get to this soon, soon enough, so it's a zoom thingy thingy. Alright, Garrick Mach. Salvation. Chapter 14. Here we go. <laughs> But yeah, Garrick Mach is under attack by the combined forces of the kingdom and the church. Oh, they're both here. Uh, aware that the Federation must honor its pact, you march for the monastery to aid the Empire. And we get a cool little thingy thingy for an S rank reward. Hopefully we get that. And I missed to do a thing. Crap. Oh well. <laughs> the situation is grim. The kingdom army and the Knights of Saros have the monastery completely surrounded. That's not good. And Rhea? She's here. Looks like she's commanding the Knights of Saros herself. They fight her now? With her leading the charge, the Knights' morale must be through the roof. Looks like your guess was right on the mark, Lawrence. Indeed. If anything, Edelgard's predicament is even more dire than I imagined. If you're sure you want to rescue her, we'll have to move quickly, Your Majesty. Right. Let's go, everyone. Time to save the day. Save the day. Oh, getting right to it. Okay, I thought there'd be more cut, more talk, whatever. But sure, sure, sure. Or the upper defense gate is captured. Where's the upper defense gate? Her Majesty's healers, dispatch combat engineers. Hmm. If Edelgard dies, we fail. So let's just assign healers to her, combat engineers to disrupt her plan, and stronghold sabotage because I like that. Cool, cool, cool. Fine. All right, so we got 20 minutes, 1800 to kill, defeat, and damage no more than 60% for S rank. Those are our meal effects, like usual, and um, let's see how bad this goes for us, because I'm not looking forward to it. Oh, we got a cutscene to start. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Oh, oh. <laughs> damn. <laughs> that was a. Uh... Nice shot. Some javelins. I owe you one. Honestly, it almost feels like you held back till I needed help. Far be it for me to say that you're wrong. Being owed a favor by the Emperor herself. Well then, I guess we can call it even. But don't close your ledger just yet, Claude. My quill is at the ready, Edelgard. Call in all the favors you want. I like that, that was nice. Ready, you guys? It's time we show them just what Lester can do in a fight. I will go ahead to put a stop to Dimitri and Rhea. 
Okay. Oh. Well, we've come this far. We're not about to stop now. Okay. Escort right up to the front line. All right. Well, her be rather. Cool, cool, cool. Um. Okay. You do this. You stay with that. All right. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, they're all going. Oh, that's the upper defense gate. Okay, 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 okay. Seems legit. The Monica's here. I forgot about her. Defeat the mortal savants and aid the Monica. Monica is in do not worry about me. You must attend to her. Okay. Smash that stronghold in the rubble. I'll kill some more of the because. Oh, she took damage, damage. So I need to pay attention to that more. This opportunity will not escape us. Oh snap, okay. We got fire here. If you're in an area that's burning because of blaze will take damage, however, if the blaze came from an ally, you won't take damage. Sure. They are burning Garrick Mach. No problem. That's a bold move, Dimitri. Ah uh, yes, the old set it on fire strategy. We should put that out before things get messy. I think we've got some combat engineers on standby. Maybe they could deal with all this fire stuff? With me. Oh yeah, dispatch a combat engineers. Whoops. Are we changing places? Alright engineers, you're up. Don't let them start another fire. We should team up. Try to keep up. Yeah, good to go. Wait. Okay. What? The wall collapsed. Did someone intentionally do this? Oh, uh, sure. Oh no. We need to find another route and catch up with Edelgard's go. Aid Monica? No, we did the main mission successful to aid her. Saved my life. Thank you, friends of Her Majesty. Oh, Ingrid. Oh, wait. Oh, that sucks. Did she run away? She better run, run away. I don't want to kill her. There you are, Edelgard. Your life is mine. Defeat Ingrid. Edelgard is under attack. We must have Oh. We gotta take this space here. Shit. Oh, what's Claude doing? Claude, Let's this. hurry up over here. Let's see how this goes. Who's that? Oh, is that um? I so desperately want to flee, but I can't very well do that with Her Majesty here. <laughs> That's Bernadette's dad. That's funny. So that's the Empire's Minister of Religious Affairs. He heads up the Southern Church now. If he's in trouble, we should go help. Wait, where's he at? Oh shit, he's um... I'm gonna make my way down there to help him. That's stupid. It makes sense, don't get me wrong, but... I'm not trying to do all that. I guess it's now or never. Can we take this though while we can? Okay, we did. Wait, did I open the? I did open open the gate. I can just go this way, though. And we got the chest key, so let's get this chest here real quick. All right, take it down. Accessory, cool. Attacking than defending, but I still find this whole affair to be very annoying. Didn't she attack me? I told her to attack. Why is she complaining? Give them no quarter. Mm. Uh, uh, All right, take it down. Uh, 
She's lying. Oh, is he lying? Like he wants the Majesty to basically protect him. All right, that's that done. Oh, what's Claw doing? Oh, so lots more of them? Some enemies slip out of the stronghold. We gotta take them down before they do something. Defeat the oh my gosh. Try to keep up. I don't think this will kill Ingrid right away. It'd be cool if it did. Yeah, it was defeated her, I should say, not kill her. I don't want her to die. Alright, so that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. I should have made it so I used Leonie instead of Dorothea, but oh well, it'd be like that. Stay out of my way. This is so much damage. Now I can avenge the Margrave as well. Adrestia, Lesta, none of this would have happened if it weren't for you. What? Okay. I can't go on. Take over. I'm sorry. We have to fall back. So Ingrid runs away. That's good. This is on you. Perhaps a duet? Yeah. Let's team up. Let's get him. Yeah, I'm ready whenever you are. This is on you. Excellent. Are there all of them? No, there's one more over there. I can see him. This is on you. All right. We did it. That Just should take care of all the no enemy problem. commanders around it. here. Yeah. Really, she got stuck again. I could have followed close behind, I think, but I messed that up. There's no way through. There she is. Oh. Ignite the flames once more. They will know how deeply our rage burns. <laughs> uh, well, it seems the enemy attacked them. We won't be setting any more fires. Huh? Uh, I think we prevented that. That's well, good. They were unlikely to fall for the same trick twice. Time for our next plan. Oh, we can skip my turn now. Oh. Ambush is up here. It's fine. It's not fine, fine, but we claimed all the the thing of things. So it's just the other guard needs to do her, or not only do her job, but like oh, there's a thing right there to do. I didn't see that. Take the space here now. You know Ray's gonna show up by the end of this. I feel like she is at least. She's leading the, the charge for the what's it called? The Knights of Saros. So it's like of course she'd be there. I'm not gonna probably not gonna kill her here, but you say we can get the gatekeeper, but it requires a new game plus. That makes sense to me. A character like that, I feel like has no purpose story-wise to add him. So he'd be like a bonus for technically post-game-ish type of stuff, like after the fact. Yeah, we're definitely gonna play a, a new game plus though. Oh shit, he's just gonna end, end this? Uh, defeat the do. I don't wanna do that. Dimitri's most loyal retainer. I must be getting close now. Gosh. 
called the lower house. I feel like we're not gonna get the kill requirement. This is 1800 kills, but this says this 20 minutes before the match. So it's been like, what, seven probably? I could check, but it's been eight minutes. I mean, 500 more kills basically. So some story thing happens that is like ridiculous probably. Like with the chapter eight, I think it was. Or was it chapter seven? Um, when you fight, uh, what's his name's dad? Caspar. I forgot about Caspar. He didn't join us yet either. Alright, so we got that out the way. I would sooner fight to the end, but that would bring great pain to his majesty. So who's up this way? I probably should heal them away a bit. Eliminate Dimitri and force the kingdom troops to retreat. Hey, look, I used to hurry up. Okay, here we go. Why is everyone down down south? Why isn't she using her axe, the special axe? The relic axe. I'll take up position here and stop the enemy from invading. I cannot allow you to do this alone, your majesty. Please permit me to fight alongside you. She walking? Long awaited this day, Aengard. Your tyranny ends here. Oh. Defeat Dimitri. All right. Oh, this is not good. We can't let Edelgard die. We must seize this opportunity while the kingdom Try army is engaged. Up. Quickly, capture the front gate of the monastery. Yeah, good to go. Capture the front gate of the monastery. I don't know who said that. Oh, Rhea's a people. Oh shit, good thing they have people down south. I mean, we should defeat Rhea. We've got to defeat the Minchin to defeat Rhea. Okay, let's send my guy down there, because we already. Oh, wait, what's she wearing? She is a saint. Using the Sword of Stairs plus 50. Okay, it's, uh, I don't like that. But cool, cool, cool. Is there another secret path we don't know about? Another secret path, of course. The Kingdom Cavalry and the Church are launching an attack on our strongholds. Defeat the Great Knights. Okay, I can deal with them. Um, what's his name right now? Look at Rhea. <laughs> no matter how many years pass, you people will always be little more than fools. What do you mean by you people? Return the land you stole from us. Okay. No reason to hold back before the enemy of the Margrave and my people. Right, right. But on the other hand, it'd really make my day if you withdrew. <laughs> you know? Moth is certainly a strategic location, but it's truly essential to the kingdom. Perhaps. If we control this land, we will be in a better position to ward off your invasions. Yes. That's fair. <laughs> if it's my head you're after. You'll have to risk your own to take it. Stop Dimitri with everything you've got. Hold nothing back. Hey, cool. That side mission was easy because of our guy being pretty high level in a way, but not really. How much time do we have? We have 10 minutes. We need to kill 250 more people. Cool, cool, cool. is our church's most sacred site. We must reclaim it. What is my guy doing? Can you so not a problem. Attack Rhea. I've got this. Oh, why is he not targeting Rhea? Leave this one to that's Okay. <laughs> Didn't someone have what's it called? Talk or no? Oh shit, she got burned. That's not good. How much damage do we take? Oh. Damage wise, you're about to mess up. I don't like that. It's not good. Switching it out, huh? Come with me. I guess it's now or never. Wait, you're asking me? Out you go. I'm sorry. I think I'd rather fight you instead. 
I will correct the mistake I made when I took you in by ending your life. You shall face retribution for violating this sacred realm. This is our chance to take out your ambition. We must not let it pass us by. Only a little more. A little more, and Garrett Mock will be mine again. I should have kept the awakening going, but that's when you used to be special. But she's gonna Wait, mess up stuff on the side. Out you go. Oh, I got her. Cool. I gotta take out Dimitri. Seems the opportunity has slipped through our fingers. Take a break, we shall return. The next time you will not be so fortunate. All right, cool, cool, cool. He managed to hold out, but Rhea got away. I need to kill 50 more people to get S rank. Are 50 more people gonna spawn here or no? I feel like it's gonna be no. Time wise, we're good, we're chilling. But I need more things to show up. It would make sense to bring Hilda up here because the axe is better against the Lance. But either way, this should kill him. Oh no, there's still stuff to do. It's still on Lang's attack. Very well. Turn your horses around. So it's not it. Where are we going? What's, what else is there to do? We killed the we defeated Rhea, we defeated Dimitri. Oh why is she here? Her class is different, on the on the map at least. The time has come for my revenge. Oh. Prepare yourself. That's Solthus's voice. The Demon. Now we must deal with an even more formidable foe. That's annoying. Defeat her once and for all. We're not winning this thing unless we take out the Ashen Demon. Okay. Yeah. Demon has appeared. Now is our chance to settle the score. I'm on it. I won't lose this time. We're gonna need that power of yours to win. You got this. Out of the way! I got you now. Hmm. I've got a little something of my own. Where is Balthus? You shall be punished for murdering the sire of my vessel. She calls an arrogant spec. The monster's losing control. Now's our chance to finish it. Where is Balthus? Hold on, that bothers me more than it really should. Oh, he's right here. Okay. <laughs> Everyone just do all of the attack. We're good. She said a tone at once. You heard that? Twice. Do it. Oh wait, here we go. <laughs> Just kick him. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, Sothus left her body. Ooh. 
Okay. You finally done it. The Ashen Demon is no more. Mm-hmm. You don't sound too pleased with yourself. Yeah, I don't know. I know I should be. But now that it's over, I just feel kind of empty. Hmm. What if all this was just some horrible mistake? What if there was another way we could have solved all this? Sorry. I shouldn't be dumping all this on you. There's nothing to apologize for. You're processing a lot right now. I'm not sure what it means to feel happy and empty and regretful all at the same time. But I think I'm going through it myself, too. Though I wouldn't call it happy, per se. More like free. Like I finally finished a quest I thought would never end. The relief could practically move me to tears. I... Hey, are you crying? I'm... I'm not sure. But I do know this. I'm beyond grateful for everything you've done for me. I couldn't have asked for a better partner in destiny. Same here, friend. Hmm. Damn. I looked it up and we fucked up. <laughs> uh, because you can recruit Byleth if we did something right. But we didn't do any we didn't do it right though. And it's because of chapter ten what we did in chapter ten. Us fucking up in chapter ten made us not be able to recruit Byleth, it seems. So that sucks. <laughs> oh well. And because of what we did, um, the final chapter is coming up next. Because recruiting Byleth unlocks two secret chapters, it says. So we would have gotten chapter 15 and chapter 16. But because we fucked up, we're going straight to the final chapter. Uh, not gonna forget this. So I have to do this route again too. Which sucks, because I'm not trying to do this route again. This 10 and 10 we're watching mess up again. <laughs> Thank you, Claude. I owe you a great debt. So by 100% in the game cause you to be able to end up with that. Unable to 100% the game, it's trifling. <laughs> yeah, we really saved your skin. Though I'm sure you would have preferred to have us in your debt instead. Must really chafe having the shoe on the other foot. Hmm. And what is that supposed to mean? If all you plan to do is mock me, then perhaps I'll not honor the debt after all. Damn. Hey, it was just a joke. Just something Lawrence said. Nothing for your Imperial Majesty to worry about. <sighs> Jokes aside, do you have a minute? Eager as I am to get back out there and chase down our enemies, we need to talk. If you insist, what is it? Right now, the Federation and the Empire are fighting together against the Kingdom. But honestly, I have no desire to see Fargus in ruins. I'm only after the Central Church. At this point, though, wouldn't you say the two are one and the same? I'm not so sure. When Dimitri decided to grant sanctuary to the Central Church, he really wasn't in any position to refuse. If he had, the chaos that ensued would have torn Fargus apart. But what if things are adding up differently now? It's clear the war will drag on so long as he continues to shelter them. Besides, the Federation's Eastern Church and the Empire's Southern Church are both operating independent of Rhea's influence. The Central Church must be looking like a pretty heavy burden to Dimitri right about now. That makes sense. And hey, it's not like the Kingdom wouldn't still have the Western Church. Perhaps, but the Archbishop has far more influence in Fargus than anywhere else. Even if Dimitri has changed his mind, I doubt those around him would be open to the idea. The fact remains that the Kingdom has yet to show any sign of severing ties with the Central Church. They stand beside them even now. This is just a theory. Well, actually, it's more like wild speculation. But what if the reason Dimitri tried to take Eric Mach was because he wanted to distance himself from the Church? By facilitating Rhea's return to Garrick Mach, he could be trying to set the stage to break away. That's an interesting theory. Do you have any evidence to support it? Not really, but that's the impression I got when I saw Dimitri on the battlefield. To be honest, it didn't even occur to me before now. 
We were so determined to take down Rhea in that battle, we never spared a thought for Dimitri's motivations. Hmm. I see. Had it occurred to you sooner, you would have had quite the decision to make. About whether to leave me for dead, I mean. <laughs> After all, if the Central Church was really leaving the kingdom to return here, abandoning me would have been the expedient choice. Oh, come on, Edelgard. Sure, we've had our differences, but that doesn't mean I want you dead. <laughs> I'm happy to hear you say that, even if it is a lie. <laughs> you wound me. It's the honest truth from the bottom of my heart. So you say. No matter. You should continue to do as you see fit. And I will do all I can to bring this war to an end. I forgot her voice was off with the microphone until her line two, two sentences ago. It's messed up. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. Let's end this war. Right now, that's all that matters. I will pursue the kingdom's army westward, conquer Aryan Road, and take control of Fargus. And I'll go north after the Knights of Saros. I'll defeat Rhea and dissolve the Central Church. All right. Let us hope the paths we walk continue side by side. And don't forget that you owe me for today, Edelgard. If our paths do collide, I'll expect to see that debt repaid. Hmm. And that's that. And because we messed up, we're going to the final final chapter, I guess. Sucks. Sad times.